What do you like the most and least about your personality? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> well, I <laughs> I have a list. <laughs> This is insane. TikTok made me buy it. You know you're getting old when you get excited for like the most random stuff. And of course, just like any other video of mine, all of my affiliate links for all of these products are gonna be in the description box. Wow, you need this. So of course, links down below. Okay, hello ladies and gentlemen. What's up? So not long ago, I did a TikTok made me buy it video and let's just say you guys really liked it. You liked it so much that you actually wanted me to do a lot more of them and I kind of failed and like kind of just didn't do any, so. Oh. And of course, don't forget to subscribe and follow me on TikTok, follow me on Instagram. You know, just follow me, subscribe. If you want more content, baby content. Okay, so. <laughs> This first thing, fun fact about Alicia. She talks in third person and she loves rice. If you don't watch my vlog channel, you're honestly really missing out because uh, I did a very satisfying video of me organizing this chore. Hot damn. Hot damn, ooh, sexy. You know, you're getting old when like, <laughs> that turns gone. <laughs> <laughs> the next little gadget. And I saw this girl on TikTok use this little machine thing to make the perfect little rice balls. It looks like this. Supposedly you're supposed to just put some rice in and then you just shake it like this. Okay, so you just close it. Oh my God, and then you shake it. And then you have like the perfect little rice ball thing. I don't know either, but I thought it was so cute. Okay. Ah, okay, I don't, I really don't know what happened here. Um, but as you can see, it gives you like the perfect little just ball of rice. <laughs> Okay, I'm getting claustrophobic. Need to move some of this ish. Okay, the next thing that I got, this had such good ratings on Amazon and I feel like I'm a sucker for that. I'm like, okay, if literally 6,000 people say something is five stars worthy, then I mean, I need to try and see for myself. This is a three-in-one avocado slicer. Okay, I just already have high hopes for this. So we have an avocado right here. Oof. One side does this. Damn, this avocado went to private school. <laughs> I figured it's a TikTok video, so I might as well. Then, oh no, what's happening now? We need to clearly get the seed out, but like, how do we do that? Oh, I don't know, maybe we just use the seed remover that's in the middle of it? You have to know that's dope. That's sick. No more getting your knife stuck in it. Oh my gosh. This could be all yours for a whopping $9.99. Oh. My God. Honestly, feels sturdy. I feel like this is worth the money. This is a kitchen gadget you need. The next things that I got are organization and anyone else. Are you good? I'm, I'm good. We're Gucci. <clears throat> Anyways, I found these water bottle holders so that way they can be displayed and they lay flat so it's easier to pick any water bottle you want instead of having them in the cabinet and they're all the way in the back. It's just supposed to kind of organize it way more or I also saw these being used in the fridge which I don't think I'm gonna do that but I did like the idea of like that's what it's supposed to look like. So it was $25 but you get two of them so then I just ended up getting two orders total. Okay, so we have a problem in this house. I'm mostly to blame. That's gonna look good. Wow. This is gonna be so nice. Oh my gosh. I swear these are the type of things that like you don't think you need until you get it. And then suddenly you realize all that you've been missing out on. I feel like it's not even that it saves space as much as just makes it easier for you to grab whichever one you want. Because like these could all definitely fit on the shelf, but I feel like it's just so much neater now. That's amazing. Oh my God, I'm surprised we haven't done this sooner. It's gonna be so much easier just to pick whichever one you want. Wow, love kitchen organization. Okay, this was probably what I was most excited about out of everything. This was a bag sealer that apparently you can reseal chip bags, cereal bag, basically any bag. I've sneezed, I've sneezed, I've sneezed, I've sneezed. I've sneezed. <laughs> Okay, it basically looks like this little stapler thing. Please comment below if you've seen this on TikTok because it literally was going that viral. Essentially, it heats up and you just 
The second I found this, I knew I had to do this video because I was so curious. I was like, does this work? But TikTok made me buy it. Have you seen this on TikTok? No. I don't, I don't, I don't TikTok much. It's okay, it might get pants. So I'm stoked to see if this works. What's it doing? What do you think? Is it melting yet? Did oh, it work? Yeah. I need to do this little corner. Is it like ironing it shut? It literally. What? This is insane. Like all this Whoa. is sealed. Um, oh my God, this is insane. Recommend. Big recommend. Big, big, and it's rechargeable too. Oh, Iconic. Stop. Okay, so next I got these organization little canister jars, and I actually got these for our kitchen because I thought it'd be really cute just on the counter. I did that thing where I was like, where exactly am I gonna put these? I'm not sure, but I'll find a spot for them, and I just thought they were so perfect. For the longest time, I've been looking for white canisters, and surprisingly, I found them on Amazon. Like, I was looking at all the bougie stores. I was looking at freaking CB2, Crate and Barrel, Williams Sonoma, Target, like all these different places and surprisingly I found them on Amazon like aren't they so cute they're white they're definitely glass as you can probably hear and then the top is just like this wooden lid and they're just like really cute so I got every size I thought they'd be cute to kind of just be on the kitchen counter or in the bathroom or something super cute okay did I do a good job yeah literally guys we've been wanting white canisters for a while and I feel like God, I nailed it not gonna lie I honestly just pictured them kind of like here wait 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 what about, I think they look better over there. The clock could go over there. Yeah. That's cute. That's cute. No, it looks cute. I think it could be Are a lot closer. Are they too small? Closer. Should they have been bigger? No, I think oh, it could be no. a lot closer to the oven. Here. Yeah. Oh my God, cute. I like that. Then, you know you're getting old when you get excited for like the most random stuff. Literally, I got so excited when I found these. They're just these silicone utensil things. Is it called utensils? Spatula utensil set? I just thought they were so cute. I like how they're silicone, which is a lot better for your pots and pans. Like, I, I, who am I? I used to haul about like, you know, back to school supplies and now I'm here being ecstatic about kitchen utensils. She's grown. I love the wooden handle because they look so much more expensive. Like I would fully believe these are from William Sonoma and are a hundred dollars when like a bitch got them on Amazon. And I thought they'd be really cute to put in the canister next to the stove or something. I mean, I know, guys, I know. So these were $34. They were actually on sale though. They're normally 50. I hope these look good. I just thought I would look really cute. Cute, I like how you can still see the wood. Or do you think they should have been all wood? Did I mess up? No. Did I have too much white? <laughs> so should this go with the other canisters? Oh, that's kind of cute. cute. Oh my God, that's kind of cute. Cause now it's like raising the bar. Yeah. Even though these two are the same size. Wait, I love raising the bar. Ding. I just feel like it looks so much more sophisticated and just it looks like you literally have your life together when you have your freaking kitchen utensils matching. Okay, so my whole life goal is just to be like Miss Remy Ashton and she has her entire fridge organized. So these are actually the organizers that go in the fridge and as you can see, you can just put drinks on them and that way when you grab one, it rolls and it's just all nice and organized. So ecstatic for these. Okay, I'm really excited to see these in our extremely messy fridge. Let's be real. I want to be Miss Remy Ashton, but I'm not. Mr. Me Ashton. Sizing was a little weird, so we ended up just putting them upright, but I feel like it's so nice. Oh my god, it looks so good. It's super nice just having them all organized. I'm like shaking. I look like I have my life together. Does that look good? Is yeah, it no, that looks good. Is it the leftovers that makes it look weird? The leftovers makes it look terrible. Okay, dope. Next is something that literally is going to be game changing for your life, you guys. I had no idea this existed. I believe this was around $20. Yep, it's a whopping $19.99. Long story short, this, my friends, is a knife that you charge. How does this work? Wait, what? Okay, so apparently this is a knife, right? But it's made out of something. Softens butter for easier spreading by carrying warmth from the palm of your hand to the edge of the blade. <laughs> okay, I thought this actually turned on. Like, I thought you, like, pressed a button and it turned on a knife to, like, spread your butter. Ah, uh, I thought I was going to change lives with this one. I mean, who knows? Maybe it will still work really, really well. 
Does anyone else remember the vlog where I bought this toaster? Fun mm. fact, I used to yell at Ashley for using it because it was more like decor in my eyes. I'm literally insane. <laughs> I'm just saying, we had two, so I was like, why not use the cheaper one? Nice. Up here. I'm not paying you to not like get me. <laughs> Gosh. You're paying me? Yeah. I just want that on camera. <laughs> Anyways, the only bread we had was like hamburger buns, but like not mad at it. I literally thought this knife heated up because you turned it on and it heated up to like put butter on. But then I open it and it says it uses the heat from your hand. So then I was a little disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> We're still gonna see if it works. What is this doing here? I'm I was literally gonna ask. Come on, Ash, you're, you're supposed to tell me when well, things you look kept bad. You were yeah. holding it. Grab your butter. Are you going? Mm -hmm. You're supposed to tell me when you're going. I'm rolling. <laughs> So I just had the bright idea that I think this is supposed to be more when it's on cold bread, like a sandwich, opposed to a hot one, because the hot one would already melt it. Yeah, it's harder to I feel like it's bread. like that us seen on TV thing that's like, is this you? And you're like, I wasted 19.99. 19.99. Well, if it heated up, it would be dope as fuck. Okay, well that's a fail. Okay, the next thing that I got is this garlic peeler. I hate cutting real garlic just because you have to like and then the thing, it's hard and you have to smash it and it's just whatever. This had such good reviews on Amazon. Kind of look like manicotti noodles. Do they not? Supposedly all you have to do is put a whole garlic in here and then you just rub it like this on the counter and it, it's like so simple, but I feel like the simple inventions are the ones that like really work. I'm so stoked to try these because I hate peeling garlic. So if they work, oh my gosh, that'll be amazing. Okay, to be honest, I'm just really excited to see if these work. So apparently you can just put a clove of garlic, already like not peeled, in here. Uh oh. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> did not work. <laughs> oh. but I feel like the simple inventions are the ones that like really work. I think either way. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. They have a thousand four and a half star ratings. They, they have to work. Maintain pressure as you begin to roll back and forth. Tip out, peeled. I, I did that. Were you that. pressing hard enough? Uh, maybe not. I thought I was. But here I think I pressed too hard. Oh. I mean, it makes it easier to peel. Like, there it is. There she is, you know? Maybe that's all it's supposed to do. Yeah. The next thing that I got is another kitchen gadget. This is an herb tool. Yo, I'm about to make the best guacamole. I'm about to be shredding cilantro like no other. It just has all these blades down here, so all you have to do is like, and then you're left with the perfect finely chopped herbs, cilantro, rosemary, basil, whatever you want. I'm really hoping this one works. Okay. Oh. oh my gosh. I feel like I barely even started and it's like, wow. Ash, are you ecstatic? Very, that's a great tool. That took literally 0.2 seconds to do. I really should have not put it on a wet cutting board. It's like salt bay, but cilantro bay. It was like splat. Wow, definitely buy this. So yes, that is literally everything that I got from Amazon recently. But seriously, thank you guys so much for watching and for the question of the day. Please make me feel better and comment below something that you've also purchased because of TikTok. Yes, comment below. And of course, say it with me. Buy the merch, shop Alicia Marie, link down below. Love you guys so much. I'll see you next time. Bye.